Hi, Mayor Tyler with your September 10th regular council meeting update. I was late getting to the meeting last night, so Deputy Mayor Kevin Lonsdale chaired the meeting. He did a great job and thanks very much for covering me. Today we're at CHIPS, which is Wetaskiwin Children's Indoor Play Society, located in the mall on the south side. CHIPS is a non-profit organization created by moms and dads to give preschool kids a place to play and interact during the long winter months. Find them on Facebook at CHIPS Wetaskiwin for more information. Thanks for letting us use your playground for our video today. To start things off for the council meeting, we had a public hearing on the rezoning of the property that was recently sold across from the water tower to direct control. There wasn't anyone wishing to speak to this. We have a special council meeting coming up on Monday, September 17th at 7 p.m. to finish off the bylaws for cannabis in Wetaskiwin. It is an open meeting and you are invited to join us in council chambers. With that on the horizon, we had two delegations speak to us at the council meeting regarding cannabis. I would like to thank Gwen, Laura, Brett and Kyle for taking the time to present to council. The property that we had the public hearing on then needed to receive second and third reading to rezone it from urban services to direct control. The new owners have two years to develop that piece of land. Next, we gave all three readings to the bylaw on committee code of conduct, which you can find on our website under Monday's agenda. We also had second and third reading for the FCSS advisory board. Please contact Lucienne at City Hall for more information. The plastic checkout bag ban public engagement results were presented by Jacqueline. We received a lot of feedback from both residents and businesses. Thank you very much. We had over 300 people in favor of the ban with only about 160 opposed. The rest of the survey results can be found in the agenda on our website as well. Council has asked for the bylaw to be brought back for approval and we should see that at our next meeting and if approved, the ban will take effect in the next nine months. This will allow retailers to use up the stock of bags that they have as well as give residents time to adjust to the change. Council then reviewed and approved the updated performance management policy for city staff. Next, we received a report on curbside recycle and compost. This lengthy report is also on the website in our agenda if you'd like to read it. Options will be brought back to the Council during the 2019 budget in November. Budget meetings are open to the public and will be taking place the week of November 19th. Fleet and equipment pool review was up next during our Council meeting. We are always looking for the best practice in how the city is operated so we get updates from our directors regularly. Some events to mark in your calendar. Wetaskiwin City Council will be hosting and taking part in the first annual Moscow Chiefs Wetaskiwin Peace Hills Cup on September 23rd. In the spirit of treaty and friendship, I have been working with Samson Cree Nation Councillor Mario Swampy to help bridge the communities. Needless to say, there is a strong sense of friendly competition and the trash talking is in full swing. Any golf tips you have are most welcome and if you'd like to hang out at the driving range in the next couple of weeks, that'd be much appreciated. The Iceman's home opener is also Sunday, September 23rd at 6 p.m. as they host Sherwood Park. The Iceman will be defending back-to-back -back league championships as well as getting ready for provincials that Wetaskiwin is hosting in April of 2019. The annual Mayor's Prayer Breakfast has been set for October 6th. You'll be able to get tickets from City Hall. If you have an event coming up, please post it on my Mayor Tyler Gannam Facebook page. As always, you're encouraged to join the Mayor Tyler Gannam Facebook page. Questions, comments and suggestions are always welcome. Thanks for joining me today. Have a great week. Take care.